This is Bumper to Bumper TV. This is a long way from the mental image many of us have of Korean automobiles. The 2016 Kia Sorento has moved into the upper echelon of crossovers with a design that can rival luxury competitors. We focus on the looks because Kia has spent a lot of time and energy refining the lines of this platform and that's the first thing buyers and drivers notice. Depending on the trim level, the Sorento is either a two or three row offering with seating for seven, taking up 187 inches on the roadway. Somehow, it manages to make the last row a bearable space for two adults, albeit a short ride. Steering and handling can be adjusted to a driver's preference. We like the sports setting for a tighter response. The base level comes with 17 inch wheels and 19 inch rims are part of the package for the top of the line SX Limited. Of course, front seat passengers get preferential treatment with 44 inches of legroom and a center console which can match up well with luxury nameplates. The second row is also a clear demonstration where attention to detail is successful. Kia is smart enough to recognize that families travel with mobile devices which need to be charged, so there are plenty of power outlets for passengers. With the latest version of Uvo, the Sorento will respond to verbal orders using Siri technology and be able to access the web via a hotspot from a smartphone, which uses an existing data access plan rather than having to create and pay for a separate one. The all-wheel drive version tipped the scales at 4,300 pounds, but it was no problem for the drivetrain. Kia is staying with what works. There are two four-cylinder engines, a 2.3-liter and a 2-liter version. There is also a 3.5-liter V6 engine, which cranks out 290 horsepower and 252 foot-pounds of torque. All are gasoline direct injection plants, and they are all aluminum blocks and heads using 87-octane regular fuel. Tied to a six-speed automatic transmission, even the all-wheel drive version delivered some pretty respectable fuel economy in city driving. Something we also liked is the around view camera system, which comes in handy during tight parking maneuvers, considering it's difficult to eyeball where the right rear wheels are going using the outside mirrors. With this North American built version of the Sorento, Kia has moved from another player in the segment to an influencer for what the industry will have to deliver over the next few years. This is Greg Morrison. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper TV at cs.com.